I would encourage you very, very strongly with all of these seed storage, self-custody approaches or solutions you use to be very careful not to exceed your technical capability and the technical capability of your heirs by making things too technical and not redundant enough. For the vast majority of people, the, the risk of theft is much, much lower than the risk of loss. If you have cold storage, if you have a seed that's backed up and you use a hardware wallet, the chances of you having your money stolen other than through a social engineering attack are very, very, very low. In fact, I have personally never heard of someone using a hardware wallet and a seed that they've backed up getting their seed stolen from their backup location. I've never heard of that. I have heard of people getting social engineered and typing their seed into a website in a panic. That's happened many times. But I have also heard hundreds probably of examples now of people losing their money because they tried to implement some kind of convoluted encryption scheme, which in the end, maybe even allowed a hacker to steal their keys from a, a compromised laptop that happened recently to even a core developer, a Bitcoin core developer. The chance of you losing control of your own keys and then losing all of your money is much higher due to a mistake, due to overcoming your technical ability, or due to a natural disaster than the risk of someone breaking into your house, breaking into a safe, and stealing a seed that you know is there and nobody else knows is there. Please consider supporting me on patreon.com slash A-A-N-T-O-N-O-P. Thank you.